Hey, how you doing? Welcome to this new episode where I'm going to show you how to properly use the top-down Phoenix scope in order to diagnose a high voltage electric motor. This is the starter generator from a Hyundai Ionic. How in the world am I going to diagnose this electric motor to make sure it's working fine or not? I already set up the oscilloscope and also we're going to use the top-down Phoenix Max. But in order to find out if the phases are working properly, I need to give it a little juice to the electric motor. Now watch the screen and let's see what's happening. Here we go. Let's create a sine wave. All right, let's see. I have the green face and the purple face are kind of fine, but look at the yellow one. The yellow face looks like kind of small, right? Probably one of the coils beginning to burn out, if it's possible, but one thing for sure, look, this motor is definitely not in good condition. And if this happens by chance, of course the computer is going to detect that the electric motor is not working properly and it will trigger a diagnostic fault code. Always better to use the oscilloscope because it's also a digital multimeter that measures voltage against time and graphics the result, which is exactly what we're doing in this case. There's going to be one diagnostic video every single week if you want to learn how to properly use the Top Down Phoenix Max or the Top Down Phoenix Scope because the every once a week tutorial video are going to be amazing. So if you want to learn more, stick around for more tips. Bye bye.